Please welcome Stephen Schillander as a member of the Shippensburg University Athletic Hall of Fame. I just want to start by, again, thanking Shippensburg University and the Hall of Fame Committee for this induction. Uh, it's definitely a huge honor. Um, I think being a native of Shippensburg, you know, we, we interact with the university in different ways growing up, uh, but having this uh, induction into the Hall of Fame being this kind of lasting thing to be a part of is, is really special. Um, I want to thank my parents for all the support over the years. Um, my mom's here. Uh, thank you for just, I think, Supporting a sport that sometimes for cross country you see your kid run away <laughs> and you kind of wait there for hopefully not too long and they come back. <laughs> and so sometimes not the most entertaining of sports, but I appreciate the support to that uh, and sticking it through the track season where you can watch your own laps. Um, so I definitely appreciate all the, the time spent at meets and uh, races to my wife Heidi as well uh, for continuing to support me as I try to do some training here and there. Uh, she's also a runner and so a lot of give and take of the training these days with our three kids. Um, I was fortunate to first meet the Spence family whenever Neely showed up uh, on our team at our junior year, Heidi was there too, and we're like, this is what distance running actually is supposed to look like. <laughs> um, we, we were well coached, we really loved what we were doing, but we saw a whole other level of athleticism and commitment. Um, and so I, I'm very grateful that Coach Spence recruited me, even though I probably wasn't the most committed person at the time. I had some inconsistencies in my training. Uh, even the summer before I started here at SHIP, I think I logged some questionable mileage in our sheet, uh, but he stuck with me <laughs> through that. Um, and I just want to express gratitude to all the coaches uh, for the cross country and track and field teams um, who are part of my life those four years and even beyond. Uh, I hope you never underestimate the impact that you truly have on your student athletes. Uh, and the way you provide a sense of family among your teams. Uh, it's, it's definitely not just let's go out and compete, it's a let's get this done together, let's work on a personal development, and let's do this as a, as a group. Um, and beyond helping your athletes improve their performances, you also have a huge part in helping what I see as kids become adults. You kind of take these 18 year old kids that are a little bit listless, not sure what's going on, and hopefully by the time kick us out the other side, we're productive members of society. <laughs> and I've, I've seen that for myself, and I've seen that for many of my teammates as well. Um, I know for Coach Spence in our preseason cross country camp, uh, he talked about living the lifestyle. So this idea that commitment and success in athletics and academics go hand in hand. Um, they get to do the little things to make this possible. It's, it's the little things that build up to make you move forward in these, in these items. Um, and so I don't run as quite as much as I used to, but I know that I apply the same mindset now of commitment and doing little things when I approach my career and my family, which I'm hoping produces the same outcome. Also grateful for my teammates. My athletic accomplishments would not be possible without those guys who also did the work with me day in and day out. Uh, waking up at 7 a.m. on a Sunday to run up and over South Mountain, which was not at the top of our priority list, but knowing we did it together and we would get out there and just uh, run out those miles and, and make it happen was, was special. Um, and those guys became awesome friends. Some of us have you know, gone to each other's weddings in recent years and just continue to be part of this community. Uh, I always appreciated the passionate speeches that Coach O would give prior to our conference championships, getting us all fired up to go out and dominate our events. Um, in recent years, with how dominant the, the team has been, I, I'm not sure if they dig extra deep to try to really motivate. We <laughs> went by lots of points. But um, I, uh, during our, our, as, as Alden mentioned, we do the Pride Team Tradition Chant, um, and I'm grateful that I get to continue to be part of the tradition of Shrewsbury University Athletics, and I just want to again thank the Hall of Fame Committee for this induction. Thank you.